Hello everyone, and welcome to today's video on how to make money woodworking. In this video, I'm going to share with you some tips and tricks on how to turn your woodworking hobby into a profitable business. Woodworking is a fantastic hobby that can also be a great way to earn extra income. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced woodworker, there are many ways to make money from your woodworking skills. So let's get started. The first step in making money woodworking is to identify your niche. This is crucial to the success of your business as it will help you focus on creating products that cater to a specific market. One way to identify your niche is to think about what type of woodworking you enjoy the most. Do you prefer furniture making, carving, or perhaps something else? Consider your skill level and the tools and materials that you have available and choose a niche that you are passionate about. Once you have identified your niche, it's important to research the market and make sure that there is a demand for the types of products that you want to create. You can do this by attending craft fairs and other events, researching online marketplaces, and talking to potential customers. To create high-quality products, you need to invest in quality tools and materials. While it may be tempting to cut corners to save money, this will ultimately hurt your business in the long run. Make sure that you are purchasing high-quality wood, as well as the tools that you need to create your products. This includes saws, sanders, routers, and other essential woodworking tools. Investing in quality tools and materials will not only improve the quality of your products, but also increase your efficiency and productivity. This will ultimately help you save time and money, and allow you to produce more products and increase your revenue. Before you start promoting your products, it's a good idea to create a portfolio of your work. This will allow potential customers to see the quality of your work and get a sense of your style. Include high-quality photographs of your products, as well as descriptions of each piece. Make sure that your portfolio is professional and well-organized. You can also create a physical portfolio that you can bring to craft fairs and other events. This will allow potential customers to see your products up close and get a better sense of the quality of your work. Now that you have your business plan, tools, materials, and portfolio in place, it's time to start promoting your products. One of the best ways to promote your products is through social media. Create a Facebook or Instagram page for your business and share photos of your products with your followers. You can also use social media to announce upcoming events or promotions. Another way to promote your products is through online marketplaces such as Etsy, Amazon Handmade, and eBay. These platforms allow you to reach a large audience of potential customers and provide an easy way to sell your products online. Make sure that you factor in the cost of shipping and handling when setting your prices, and that you have a clear understanding of the fees associated with selling on these platforms. In addition to social media and online marketplaces, you can also promote your products through local craft fairs and other events. These events provide an opportunity to showcase your products, meet potential customers, and network with other artisans. Setting your prices is a crucial part of making money woodworking. You need to make sure that you are pricing your products competitively, but also making a profit. To determine your pricing, you need to consider the cost of materials, your time, and your overhead expenses. Make sure that you are factoring in all of your costs, including the cost of your tools, electricity, and any marketing expenses. It's also important to research the prices of similar products in the market. This will help you determine a fair price for your products and ensure that you are not overcharging or undercharging. Finally, make sure that you are clear about your pricing with your customers. Include your prices on your website and social media pages and make sure that your prices are clearly marked at craft fairs and other events. Another way to make money woodworking is by offering custom orders. Many customers are looking for unique, one-of-a-kind pieces that fit their specific needs and preferences. By offering custom orders, you can create a personalized experience for your customers and charge a premium for your services. Make sure that you are clear about your pricing and turnaround time when offering custom orders. Finally, it's essential to provide excellent customer service. This includes responding to inquiries promptly, delivering products on time, and addressing any concerns or issues that customers may have. By providing exceptional customer service, you will build a loyal customer base and receive positive reviews and recommendations, which can help grow your business. In conclusion, making money woodworking requires a combination of skills, creativity, and business acumen. By identifying your niche, creating a business plan, investing in quality tools and materials, promoting your products, and providing excellent customer service, you can turn your woodworking hobby into a profitable business. 
Thank you for watching, and I hope that you found this video helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below, and I'll be happy to answer them. Good luck on your woodworking journey!